Hey everybody, so I do apologize for the audio quality. I am recording this on my phone before I head off to work, but I've been getting a lot of comments from some of you saying, you're in Specto, you're getting no stream available. I'm going to show you guys how to avoid that and hopefully get a working source link and then show you a hidden gem. Well, it's not really a hidden gem. Uh, I just think it's overlooked by a lot of people, especially those of you that are brand new. Uh, if you've been using Specto for a while, you probably already know this, but we're going to go to Specto real quick. So just give me a moment since it's slower on my phone. Let me just find it in this list. There it is. So we're going to open up Specto. And uh, if you go to TV shows and then you click on networks, right here, guys, it gives you a list of all of, you know, the popular cable networks that are on regular cable so you guys can catch up on all of your tv shows it's got it's even got cinemax hbo stars and showtime so it's got premium channels on there disney channel for the kids um as you can see it's got pretty much all the popular ones it even has amazon and netflix series so you can catch all of the netflix series that are out uh, i'll just click on that to show you guys but it's got every single Netflix series that you would get if you had a Netflix membership. As you can see, all of the Netflix series. So you guys can go through that and check it out. Um, I'm just showing you this, especially for those of you that are brand new. Maybe you didn't really explore the Specto add-on that much. But um, as you can see, it's got MTV, VH1, BET. A lot of stuff these live TV add-ons don't have. Sci-Fi, TBS. Uh, so you can see it's got most of the popular ones. So, uh, you know, you can catch up on all your shows. I know it's not the same as watching it live, but I have noticed with Specto, um, whenever a TV show airs live, it's usually on Specto that night by 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. So, yeah, you may have to wait a few hours after it airs live or just wait till the next day, but then you guys will be able to you know, stay up to date on your TV shows and watch everything. So I will just do Shooter on USA, popular new season that just came out. So it's got season one. And as you can see, it's got all of the episodes. So you guys can watch that. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this in case, you know, it's overlooked or you just didn't know that this was in here. But see, it's got stars, Showtime. So it's got I'll just show you Showtime real quick. It's got all the series that you'd get on Showtime, Shameless, Ray Donovan, popular one. So if I click on that, it's got season one, two, three, and four. So you guys can watch all that. Um, and another feature that I think is overlooked, if you go to TV shows again, but this time scroll down, you can click on TV calendar. And in here, it's got a calendar. Uh, so we're on February 2nd, Thursday. If you click on it, it shows you every single TV show that's airing today or tonight. So as you can see, this is everything that will be airing on February 2nd. Um, so it's just a ni another nice little feature so you guys can you know stay updated with what's going on. You can see what shows are coming on today or tonight. Um, so it's got a nice little calendar in there if you guys want to check that out. Um, under TV shows and then if you scroll down to TV calendar you can get to that uh, now the main thing that everybody says with no stream available um, I'm just gonna go back to networks and I will show um, an example so we'll just do Showtime and I'll go back to Ray Donovan if you uh, this is why I turned off autoplay by default because sometimes it gets issues and it'll pick the first link and I've noticed with the first link sometimes you'll Actually, the first five links, you may get no stream available. So I'll just click on the first one. Now it's going to go through all the sources, and it's going to bring up that list. And this is why I turned off autoplay, so you're able to choose in case you do get that no stream available. So as you can see, sometimes the first five uh, links on here, you may click on it, and it may come up with no stream available. So just go farther down on the list and just keep trying different sources and links until you find one that works. There's times where I had to go all the way down to 14 on the list, click on it, and that one happened to work. There was other times where I had to scroll all the way down to 25, 
and pick a source and it finally worked because the first 10 gave me no stream available so as you can see though there is a huge list um, over a hundred you know sources and links that you guys can try so for those of you that keep commenting saying nothing works and all you're getting is no stream available I don't think you've actually tried every single link so especially if you get this happening on the first five of these links just go farther down on the list and try a different one and usually you'll find one that will finally work for you if the first five don't always try the first five but if they don't just scroll farther down this list you may have to go all the way down to 30 um you may have to go down farther just keep trying links so don't comment anymore if you haven't tried every single link because one of these links is going to work for you um Sometimes you just have to, you know, keep searching and trying them out. But more than likely the first five, one of them will work for you. This is just in case it doesn't, just scroll farther down on the list and you guys should be good to go. So I just wanted to share that quick tip for you guys uh, before I head off to work. And I hope you guys have a great day. And until then, I will see you guys in my next video. See ya!